But, you know, it's been nice catching up and kind of reminiscing and all that sort of stuff about all the pranks we used to play. Because obviously, I mean, you know, being identical twins, there's a lot of cute humour and mischief to be had. And, you know, Mrs. Jones, Mrs. Jones, 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 oh, she was great. Yes, yes. Yeah, she, she used to get it, really, when, when, when basically, you know, she'd turn down to it and she'd go, you know, have you done your own work, Terry? Yeah, and, and, and I'd say, no, I'm Daniel. Yeah, and I'd go, well, actually, yeah, I'm Terry. Yeah, and, and, you know, we'd laugh we'd hysterically, laugh. really. We'd laugh. And, and, you know, she'd clip us around the ear and, and, and tell us to stop. And but she was amazing at being able to tell us apart. I mean, just like that, she'd, she'd know that I was Terry and he was Daniel. Yeah, I don't know how she managed it, really. But, but then again, the, the strange thing was about the community we were living in, that, that loads of people seemed to have that gift. And, and I just think it's obviously something in the water that makes people... Estrogen. Yeah, maybe, because that would explain his more emotional nature than me. But then again, he's older. You see. Three minutes. Yeah. We're still going to be 40 before I am. Anyway, um, there, there were other uncanny moments. Um, uh, for example, when... JR got shot in Dallas, we were watching it exactly the same time. I mean, you know, when I, first found, on that? Well, when I first found that out, it was one of those moments, you know, I mean, we can take it for granted occasionally, you know, the, the fact that occasionally we finish each other's sentences. Yes, that's right, that time, well done. Yeah, the fact that we did that, yeah, and, uh, and, and basically, you know, this was one of those moments because we both realised, you know, that in completely separate places, because we got separate... Our friends of the country. Other ends of the country, you know. In fact, you know, he's not really good at geography. I was better than him, so he doesn't realise we weren't in the same country. But never mind there. Eh? Yeah, and uh, and there we were watching watching the same channel in the early nineteen eighties where yeah. some soap actor got shot. And I mean, you know, a little known soap. What are the chances? Yeah, and it was the same with Diana. Princess Diana. Yeah, when she died, you know. Nineteen ninety-seven. Both found out exactly the same time. Same day. Both watching exactly the same program on telly. Both yeah. cried. Yeah. But he did more than I did, because he's weaker. More emotional. Weaker. More emotional. Weaker. Yeah. Funny thing is, as well, I've got another sound effect, which is, uh, this isn't my normal accent. Yeah, when, when I was younger, you know, I used to talk exactly the same as he did. did. Yeah, and, and then I woke up talking like this after the uh, incident. It's a bit like that woman in uh, Sunderland, I think it were, who suddenly woke up speaking to me. Joking, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. 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 Very uncanny, very rare. Yeah, but uh, strangely, sometimes when I'm with him, well, the accent changes back to being kind of like his again. It's the telepathic link. It, it, it's, stronger. it's stronger when we're together. It's like we're like two halves of the same tune. Lock it. Lock it. Two halves. Mashed. And, and you know, I draw my strength from him. Sometimes, you know. It makes me feel very weak at times, but, you know, I don't mind giving some of my strength. No, he's never liked that. No, not Because I'm a very giving person. We both are. That's another one of our identical traits. We're well, very giving people. He is a bit more than me, obviously. But never mind. You know, I like, I like giving of myself. Yes, he does. Rather too often, if you ask me, but that's another story in time. Now, a lot of people will basically turn around to us and say, you know, are you one of them cliché sex twins, yeah, who, you know, if one person feels pain, then the other person feels it as well. And we've had major incidences of that, haven't we? We have. Yeah. I mean, there was like your headache. Yeah. Yeah. He got an headache. Yeah. I found myself standing, you know, in front of the cabinet with some paracetamol in this hand, and I, I had no real idea why I was doing it. And, and then in this hand, I found myself with a bottle of vodka. And I stared at that, and, and I started thinking a bit. Don't think of the pain. I thought I saw one. The penguins. There's no penguins here. I've killed them all. Thank you. So, uh, yeah, moments like that one, basically. Where, uh, yes, I explained his, his headache. Uh, um, well, there was that time I was in boots. And I was in boots once. I went in there as well. I mean, <laughs> just, it's What's so the deep. odds on us both going to boots? Absolutely uncanny. That's what it is. And I was standing there and I suddenly felt this urge to reach for the hemorrhoid cream. Which, yeah. which I did. And, and when we went back through our diaries, we worked out that that was, that was when I was thinking then, and remembered what a pain in the arse he was. And there he is, buying cream. Hemorrhoid cream. Hemorrhoid cream. But that's because he's old. So anyway, if you like what you see, and uh, let's face it, you know, 
who wouldn't, yeah, then, uh, you know, drop us a line. Uh, we, we, we've been with the agency now for six about, months. Yeah, about six months, something like that. Uh, not really been that successful in terms of dates so far. People yeah. are scared of, of the, the link we have. That's, um, that's right. And there's then, the whole pain thing. Yeah, that is. There's the pleasure pain scenario, of course. You know, what the little known flip side of the headache thing is the fact that, you know, on occasion uh, we, we can actually feel each other's pleasure too. Uh, a bit like this. Oh. But thankfully, there's also this point where that gets cut off because um, we, we have dealt with the uh, penguin. It's the penguin. It's in, in slightly different ways. As I say, I, I, I reached for the paracetamol of the vodka and, and, and you reached for... What? A man? He did. And he kind of carried on reaching. Well, men. Yeah, lots of them, really. Lots and lots. Loads. Huge amount. And I, I personally, you know, well, you know, I'm really quite glad that that's one link that we, we don't actually share uh, at this point. Although I have, on occasion, felt a strange sensation while I've been doing emotions. Piles. And I've wondered. But you tend to go down the Velvet Tardis route, don't you? I do. I do. I just find it so much more spacious. For one thing, I think, you know, it's all about space. Really. I shunned it. He did. It's basically because he didn't get on with her mother quite as much as me. See, I, I, I was very attached to her and uh, and stayed that way actually. Uh, you know, they, they couldn't find any scissors and uh, you know, so I had a placenta following around for about four years. So it's only natural really that maybe I should have bonded with her just that little bit stronger than he did. Yeah. But you're not going to say that yet. No. Not at all. Not much. We, we did actually eat the placenta. Eventually. Yeah. yeah, it was a bit dusty. A bit dirty. But a bit warm. But, but, but quite tasty. But tough. Yeah, I and mean, you do have to remind yourself sometimes there's those less fortunate than yourselves, isn't there? And we both believe that very strongly. Yeah, um, unfortunately, we've generally thought it about the people that we've met so far through this dating agency, mm -hmm. haven't we? Yeah. But we do think that's because they themselves are prejudiced and most of the time just haven't been able to deal with two identical... People that are identical. You know, they follow the in thing. Every way. They they say they want twins. Passing two inches. They think they want twins. They say it's a fantasy of theirs, and then we both turn up, and what do they do? They just can't deal with no, it, and no. we have to leave again. And we'd spend forty quid. Some of them have lost, didn't they? Yeah, they did. Which I think is very rude. It is. Um, you know, we're, you're confronted with two gorgeous men, identical, identical in every single way, and. They just can't cope with that. No, so it's one of the things, fantasy and reality, it's just two completely different issues for most people. Mm. But, you know, if you think you're one of those forward-thinking types, you can cope with this, because let's face it, we do come as a pair. Um, yeah, we do it together. Yeah, we, we, we can't be separated generally, we get a bit anxious on things like that. Now that we've found each other again, it's, you know, a bit Together hard. we can keep the penguins at bay. But, singularly, we just can't. We fall apart. Like that. So, if you like what you see, I mean, how could you not like what you see, and you're not afraid of um, the immense similarity between us, um, then drop us. You want email. to think outside your box. Yeah, outside the box. If you think, if you want to think outside your box, get in touch with us because you know we can think about it, and it doesn't matter if it's big fish, little fish, or cardboard box. There'll be something for everyone. Indeed. Is that a penguin? No. It's not a penguin. Are you sure? It's not, no, it's not a penguin. Alright, well, uh, as I said earlier, I... It is a penguin. I'll get it. Get the penguin.